No Red Eye tomorrow due to election coverage. We're back Wednesday with Joe DeVito, Sam Roberts, and Matt Welch. Was her GPS trying to kill her? Short answer, yes, it was. <laughs> A Canadian woman following her directions from her car's GPS missed a turn and ended up driving down a boat ramp into a very cold Ontario Bay. The car's momentum <laughs> carried it pretty far. The woman had to swim about 100 feet to shore in water that was 40 degrees. One onlooker noted that the boat ramp is pretty wide and could easily be, be mistaken for a street. The car was towed out but is not repairable. No word on the health of the GPS device. Hmm. Okay, look, Ebony. Uh, this is this a case of I know we, we can't talk about how women and men are different behind the wheel, but I feel That's like right. women put too That's much right. trust in their GPS. Well, clearly this woman did, but I know <laughs> <laughs> that this woman right in front of you would not have done such a thing. I take my driving very seriously, and yeah. I guess it's so. You look yes. uh, well. Look, uh, I think Tim. Yeah. I like the I like the GPS. I used to love printing out my map. You like direction. You like the GPS. <laughs> I love a GPS. Sure. But I feel like I'm just going by the women in my life. My yeah. wife, it's like she'll if it says to take a turn, she's going to take the turn, even if there's a yeah. cornfield there. Yeah. Well, I mean, then they deserve to die. <laughs> right? I mean, let's be honest. Let's be honest, guys. <laughs> then they deserve uh, God's final judgment. But look, this is a very, we're in a small window here, Dennis, where we have the GPS devices. Pretty soon the cars are going to drive themselves, so maybe this problem is going to work itself out. That's the, uh, that's the thinking. My wife, who is here, is a big fan of self-driving cars. She thinks drivers are the entire problem oh. on the highway, <laughs> and she thinks this driver is the biggest problem. Really? On the highway. By the way, that is a... a Question for another evening with you: Is there any wife who thinks her husband is a good driver? Well, that's. I think uh, my wife does. I, I'm afraid to ask her now, guy. Right. What do you no, think? No, no, no. I don't think they have been made. That there, woman has not been made. There is something about GPS devices that causes a lot of people to just abandon all reason. Correct. You're just sort of like, well, I, my brain is switched off. And I'm just going to do, this appears to be a boat ramp, <laughs> but gosh darn it, Siri's telling me to keep going, so I'm just going to, you know, and then all of a sudden you're swimming out of your car, and you should really turn your brain on, and, and let me be as clear as I possibly can. Ignorance is not a virtue in this case. Yeah, that was another not, good recall, Once again, guys. from President Obama. Really nice. Now, you said people, <laughs> but were you talking about women, or you, no. you, you were being... You were opening it up. Yeah, no, there are bad okay. men who are driving. Right, I'm please. the sexist. All right, very special thanks to Ebony K. Williams, Tim Dillon, Guy Benson, and Dennis Prager. That does it for me. I'm Tom Shalhoub. I have a little extra time, so I'm going to drink from my red-eye mug. Hmm? Hey, guys, what do you think of this? I got my own mug. Oh, great. That's cute.